Tim Smith of the Smith Group, Colwell Banker Realty. I'm here with a good friend, Ben, who I've known for years, and we've worked alongside each other just in different aspects of real estate. So Redwood West, you guys started in 2014, and you, I mean, I'm inspired by it because you have done something I probably wish I would have done, <laughs> right? And you've mixed the perfect marriage between residential and commercial because generally when people look at commercial, it's ROI, it's all about the numbers. Here, what you're giving is ROL. Redwood West 2014, your partner's John Palmer, you guys have put together a great crew, great background in commercial real estate, acquired 350 million in assets that are these mixed-use projects on the bay, 65% market share. Tell us a little bit more about Redwood West and kind of your model. We started our careers on the brokerage side of the business, worked for a major brokerage here in Newport Beach, and ultimately, you know, always wanted to buy real estate and uh, figured out opportunities and ways for us to invest our capital into real estate to grow what we've grown today. We live in the experiential uh, real estate world. There's more to real estate than just any singular business purpose, and I think as as time goes on, you know, you need to look at real estate a little bit differently and, and we've done that through some of the projects that we've acquired, including Peninsula Village, uh, which we're sitting at here today. It's interesting because the relationship be between commercial and residential here huh? is totally different, but what's also interesting is how the, the world's changing. Yeah. Right? Now, and the opportunity that you're providing, which I want everybody to understand because if you look at just kind of our residential market, right? You look at inventory, for instance, there's no more new development. Everything's built out. But what you guys have done is come in and provided a place where you can truly work and live and have an experience. And that's gotta be difficult to find, but then also difficult to create. For all the people that are listening that don't know Newport Beach, tell us what Peninsula Village is. Well, Peninsula Village was a once in a lifetime opportunity for us to get our hands on, you know, what is the second largest development site here in the city of Newport Beach. Um, and it lended itself to, to being mixed use. We have 27 residential units. We have 40,000 square feet of office and retail. Uh, we have a 160 car parking garage. There's not a lot of parking where we are. So to have that is, is critical. And then we have 20 marina slips. So this Newport Beach lifestyle of work, live, play, hit the water really is encapsulated here at Peninsula Village. And that's why we call it Peninsula Village because everything's here. You know, when people come on site, they don't need to leave. They don't wanna leave because everything is here and the experience that we've put together for all of our residents, for all of our commercial tenants, our retail experience has is, is, is been a real draw. We're trying to create change in the city. Our ability to create something unique and special here at Peninsula Village that lends itself to all the different categories of the way in which this property will be used, you, you couldn't have a better spot to do it. There's multiple buildings that sit right in a perfect place on the peninsula, on the bay. We're sitting in a single story unit, three bedrooms, two and a half bath. There's another residential unit below, yep. or lease, and then below there's an office. I mean, I can't imagine a better place. You actually feel like you're working on vacation. That, that's exactly correct, and that was the thesis behind the experience that we were creating here at Peninsula Village. What's interesting is you literally could pull your car in here, you could shop here, you can eat here, you can take your boat, you don't really need to leave. Yeah. You can work here and live here. Of all of your projects, which are totally unique and amazing, and I'm jealous and inspired, Tell us more about Bayside Park. Bayside Park is a beautiful location right at the bridge to uh, Balboa Island. It had been a project that was developed back in the mid-70s, uh, was in major need of a, an overhaul. It's an office project, it's office and medical. And one of the unique uh, aspects of it is, is we completely redid it. We created an open air environment. We built in patios and decks. What we've tried to do is create an experience, a look, a feel that's consistent with what people want in Newport Beach. And so therein lies our ability to add value and again, create something different and unique that's gonna last from generations to come. So I've watched you guys for years and being in the residential space coming from commercial, I've seen somehow you guys have created a product that has never been done before and that there's huge demand. What do the next five years look like for you? Well, Tim, there's been a, a lot of a lot of change in the world um, over the last five years, and we've evolved with that. And so, what we've really focused on is, is lifestyle and experiential real estate. That, to me, is a key driver and a success metric for us. In that, in any different product that we do, be it office, be it mixed use, be it industrial, is to have an experiential component because that's what humans crave. 
that's how you differentiate yourself from other products in, 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 in the class that you're you know, executing within that space. So if you're looking to live, work, or have an ROL, not an ROI, return on lifestyle, check out Redwood West. Again, Peninsula Village, Bayside Park, you have stuff up in West Newport, but their model is to create a lifestyle, an experience, because that's what we all crave and desire. You can reach me, click the link below, all of their contact information, click the link below, but we'd love to see you guys talk further about their product. Thanks, Tim. Thank you.